We are back because apparently this uh, agricultural region thingy is not the demo I played the first time. This is another demo, a playtest that I didn't play. So we're going to do that because I love this game and I want to play more. So if you haven't checked out the other videos on this game, make sure to do that. Links are in the description. Like if you love Hollow Knight or Souls games, you know, it's you're definitely going to love this one. You're also going to love the merch because it's very cool, I swear. I appreciate all you that have bought it, so thank you so much. But now enough chit chat. Grab yourself a little snack, some water, and without further ado, let's begin. Okay, I mean, there's no time to waste. It's time to play some more of this. This game is crazy, man, because I'm like, this is going to be top three no matter what. But then I also remember Breath of the Wild 2 is coming out. There's a chance Silk Song will come out. Wolong is coming out in like a month. The top 10 list this year is going to be something else. Yeah, what is going on here? What? Ew, ew. Okay, what? I died. Uh, the hell is this? There's no introduction or anything. We just kind of started here. And now we got these grappling hooks. Sick. <laughs> Everything just is flawless. Like, I, I don't know what else to say about this game. Everything just feels as it looks and should, you know? Get out of my face, you freaky little worm parasite disgusting thing. I didn't like him, that's all I know. And then smoke a fat one. Oh, we can do that unlimited amounts. Nice. So we can reposition with it. Wait, that's a bell end there. What do we got? Oh, I thought it's it. Okay. Yeah, that's a fat ass in front. Okay, like the seismic function. Okay, okay, good. That. Yeah, I was gonna say, what I thought it was like a giant um Oh, nice dodge. A giant serpent would, like, pull out the water or something? Scared me a little bit. Most of them just so excited for, like, a boss in this, of course. God, I, wow, I've been hit by every one of those. Because they just explode everywhere. Come here. Free. Oh, that's a, that's a dash in that one. Wait, you. Nope. Uh, you can kind of farm a uh, thing on those guys. Die, idiot. Uh, farm charges. Uh, what's gonna spawn? This fucking... These freaks. These guys are disgustment. That's not even a word. Nope. Uh... Good shit. I'm feeling it. Give me all of that. Oh, hello. Okay, I just took that to the head. Jump. Oh, I start off with a fat one like that. I... Okay. Bum, bum, bum. Nope. Boom. I love this area, by the way. It's beautiful. And the music and ambience. Uh, who's gonna spawn? No one. These ones you can't break. They're just here to play on. Where's the giant one? Is there? It's a new character. Who is this? It's not Hing. Hello, friend. Nice day for a walk, isn't it? Uh, who are you? My identity doesn't matter. This encounter is what's important. The Daybreak Tower is my favorite place on Kunlun Island. It's extremely fortunate that fate has arranged for you to be here. See, here's the thing, though. This is a very similar design to me and my sister. And we know that from all the other characters that we all don't look like that. So I wonder if it's like, is it a family thing or is it just like a race? What tower? You mean these dilapidated ruins? My friend, things are never as they seem on the surface. Eons ago, the Daybreak Tower used to be the most magnificent magnificent altar in the palace of immortals. Ancient emperors would come here on important days to pray to the heavens. They would ask for the diviners, who have lived here for generations to divine the empire's fortunes. Praise be the sun and grant our people peace and prosperity. May the sun grant us the power to destroy our enemies. <laughs> Jesus. Please grant me sons who will extend the lifeline of the empire. If you listen carefully, you can still hear their prayers echoing faintly within these halls. That's fucking creepy. I don't understand. Praying to solve national affairs doesn't sound that effective. Thank you. Perhaps you're right. Oh, I don't like that you're like, are you opening your eyes a bit? But whether they were misguided or not, their prayers have long since been buried under the deluge of history. Battered by the winds of time, the entire belief system eroded and disappeared. People even invented a whole new way to define sun. Yep, uh, people do seem to do stuff like that. A prominent thinker once said, the heavens have passed and gone. Superstition was always a product of a bygone era. Well, it's it's a thing that will always exist. Hey, the music of the Daybreak Tower is gradually fading for the exact same reason. Such a pity. I wish you could have seen this place at the height of its splendor. The bells rang with deep majestic tones as ancient Kun people assembled here to share food, songs, and faith. It was a breathtaking sight. Oh, that's right. That reminds me. I've got a little something for you. This Gucci score is one of my treasured possessions. The bells used to fill these halls with the same melodies. See, why would you give this to me? If you, uh, also, the eye is moving. <laughs> okay, instant theory time. Her eyes or their eyes were white and empty, meaning that this thing is probably corrupting the brain and just talking, you know, as whoever is creating this fucking green shit wants them to. These souls or whatever. So just uh, an actual brainwashing thing here. Parasites are my worst enemy in life. If you manage to find the right instruments in these ruins, you should try playing some of this music. Your appetite for story seems to be wearing thin. I shall let you be on your way. As the wheel of fate turns, I'm sure we'll meet again. 
probably. Also, who are you? Uh, but let's try bringing the big bell. We can't. Okay. I mean, we can't get up there, but that's cool that we can. Okay, okay. So we probably have to find a thing and then do the puzzle and play them in the right order. Oh. Oh, no, nah, this is a normal one. God, the ambience is good here, though. I'm feeling elevated. Oh, trial room. Oh, look at that guy, though. The statue. Fucking Dracula looking guy with... F Ew, fucked up salad fingers. Also here. Fuck. Okay. Is it a mechanic we don't have? I mean... We can do that all you want, but that doesn't... Dude, oh, maybe we should have to kill it. Nope, we can't. How about this? Nope, that doesn't work either. Okay, well, we'll be back then. We're, we're learning. Ew, it's got like veins and shit, I haven't noticed. Oh, hey. Oh, it's this fucking guy again. Ooh, cheeky. Nope. Hey, yeah, you, you're just not good enough, dog face guy. Hello. Oh, <laughs> wait, that's kind of smart. If you can still see, that is. Get fucked. Playing this makes me really, really want to play the games that the devs have made before. Because I, I think I have them. I bought them, like, years ago. Detention, I think it's called. Uh, Like, are they good? I'm very tempted to just play. Just because, like, playing this makes me want to do everything the devs have done. <laughs> because it's just so good. Obviously, very, very different from this. But we cannot break this either. Are we gonna, are we gonna get, like, a big-ass fucking hammer attack or something? Like, to play the big thing, Bill, and to break these things? Or can I, like... I can't. I'm sure we'll find out soon. Hey, guy. Bum, bum. Boom. Assassinated. Beat him. Oh, okay. What, uh, what is that? Oh, that that's an enemy, right? Yes, yes, yes. It's Lady Butterfly. Oh, nice. You have just been, like, completely owned. And 101. Okay. Whoa. Boom. Ow. Nope. Bum, bum. Okay, that did have a green attack, that one. Oh, that was... It's just so clean. <laughs> okay. Wait, wait, I'm stuck. How do I get up? Let me die. I guess. Okay, that's supposed to become a rope down here, I feel like. Right? Oh, wait, I have this guy. Oh, wait a si- I forgot. This is a continuation of the other part, then. I thought this was, like, before for some reason. Wait, I can dash with this? <laughs> Sick. I'm just- I'm dumb. I literally just died for that. Okay, here's another one. Okay, wait. We use this to do it. There, it, there is a serpent. Oh, that's it. I never even realized that there might be, like, giant monster bosses in this game, too. Oh, that's fucked. They also got a giant vein there on the side of its neck. I hate that. Yo. No, are we just kind of chilling there? These guys are stupid. And they get two shot there. Bum, bum, nope. And boom. Ooh, big hits. And there we go. Damn, that looks cool. A thing to refresh our things. Nice. What is this? Looking at it. Oh, signal. Who is it? <gasps> it's Hang again. How are you, dear brother? Is it day or night where you are right now? What does the sky sh look like? I've never left Shia, so I always felt envious whenever you told me about all those faraway places. As a kid, I didn't have many friends of my age. The grass, the trees, the sky, and the stars kept me company whenever you were away. I just hate that, the, like, the entire game could be we're doing this and we're getting calls from her and shit, and she's been dead for so long and is like a fucking AI. And the way that it's all distorted and stuff, you know, it's obviously not her directly, so I wonder if it's just, like, in his mind or something. Someone's fucking with us or what the hell is going on? Remember when I first told you about hearing the roots sing? I, you thought I was hallucinating from being alone all the time. I'm hallucinating, probably. Look at all this. Like, why else would it be, like, all fucked up, RGB separated, distorted, and a bu- Why is the Death Star in this game? Holy shit. Wait, so- not only is it- I mean, that makes sense with the technology here, but we are also on other planets? Why haven't you gone to sleep yet? Are you talking to the root again? How'd you know? The weather tonight is great, so all the branches are singing. I've told you again and again, primordial root isn't sentient. You're most likely hearing random static generated by its energy. Okay, so obviously this means that the root is sentient, and possibly that she is within the root now, or something like that. Because the root was the thing that saved us. Eh, you just don't know it yet. They can be quite lively. I learned about the celestial bodies in school today. Did you know that the light from the stars in the sky are actually from a long, long time ago? A star leaves its brilliant behind as it burns itself. That light travels thousands, if not millions, of light years to reach us. Even this little detail of her having, like, this glimpse and color in her eyes, with her childish ambitions and dreams, while Yi's just, like, looking. This is an Aaron Armin moment right here. The stars might shimmer brightly, but they may have already extinguished. All that's left are the last vestiges of their final moments, echoes from the past. That's what nourishes the root. They absorb the remnants of stars, turning it into milk to feed salarians and supplies with energy. What my teacher doesn't know... 
is that all souls and dreams also end up as food for primordial roots. Well, that was faster that I got confirmed almost. That is fucking weird. This is actually some Attack on Titan shit though. It's like the roots of Yggdrasil. They emit a song as they devour. I hear the deep melody as I fall asleep each night. They sing about all the stories across this vast expanse. That's how the roots perpetuates the memories of the universe. How they nurture new stories as others come to an end for all eternity. That's so strange, man, because it, you know, the root looks so mad man-made that it very well could be but it's obviously also some spiritual shit at the same time as we can see when we go into the primordial roots like realm where we did the training there we find that old guy that we see in the trailers as well so i don't know how that is connected to stuff like it almost seems like an avatar thing a little bit i wouldn't have described primordial roots energy conversion in such a romantic way that being said that part about the root devouring dreams does sound pretty inspired hey it's captivating all that branches contain stories from the past including those of iron this is almost as if they're souls. Okay, okay, I get it. So I think that's enough. It's about time you grew up. All right, that's a little bit <laughs> straightforward there. I think it is a bit of a middle ground here because he is trying to think as logical as possible, of course. And then he's looking at Hang like, hey, you've been like a little bit superstitious even about this whole thing there. But I feel like that's truth definitely to both. The true question is who created it and for what purpose other than to be remembered as a people, you know, that that's another thing a lot of shows go into like uh, Neon Genesis, like have something that lives past our lives as a reminder to the universe or whoever's after us that we were here. Primordial Roots energy can be explained through scientific principles. I'll let you be my assistant then you can learn all about it. Stop listening to all those fairy tales and pay more attention to your studies. I'm busy with all sorts of things so I can't cuddle with you forever. You're making me worried, you know? I know what you mean. Forget about that. Look, a star. Hang isn't fucking out of her mind or anything and G isn't completely right or wrong. So I swore to never talk to them again but its voice never disappeared. I hid under the covers and replied in secret. Our calls and responses also formed a melody. See, so she's been so involved with it that she even is like here in the roots now. We can fucking somehow talk to her through them. Oh, we're not talking to her. We're, we're getting talked to. It's a fucking monologue. So it's something that she has purposely sent back to us or forward to us, whether she's alive or not. This is so much fucking better than I expected story and law wise than when I first saw the game. Even now in these dead streets and deserted alleys, only the roots still sing. So please don't worry about me, dear brother. I'm not lonely. The root brought me a bit of your story. Well, that was also that. Just a bit, hey. Um, yeah, I wonder. So when we got taken by the roots, like when we got pushed off a cliff, burst our head open and taken in by the roots. I wonder if Hing or, you know, the roots kind of got, ow, everything about us up until that point. Or if they're actually watching us every time we also go to root notes and all that. Like, oh, I don't know how, to what extent it can kind of do shit. Also, the song they were talking about is clearly the one we need. Oh, who is this fucking beast? Come here, get a backstab at least. Urgh, that's a big health bar on that. Oh, okay, okay. I like that. Oh, oh, and bam. Uh, uh, uh. Nope. Haha. -ha. And boom. Nerp. Bam, bam. Boom. Oh, wait, I didn't have anything. I, I if I had things there, I would have been dead now. Just saying. And boop. Oi, you stopped. Oh, I'm almost dead. What the fuck? Okay, that's a cool enemy, that one. I'm actually getting reminded of Sekiro in here. Like, just in the way that even normal enemies are so fun to fight and somehow more fun than lots of bosses in other games. Just because they actually have all the, the fun mechanics that I really enjoy implemented into just a normal little normal guy fight. Like, that was almost like playing against one of those uh, purple shinobi guys from Sekiro there. Also, they're filled with meat again. That's great. I still do wonder why they need to feed it meat though like it's disgusting do we directly just feed it that because as we saw in the very first demo where the game actually starts they were sacrificing humans or whatever people they are and would literally crush their heads and feed them the bodies i think because obviously like the roots are like a god kind of thing what has happened who i I'm no furry, right? But I could be. <laughs> Holy shit, that's a sick design, though. Look at that. It looks like a sneasel almost. Oh, look. Who decided to show up after all this time? Go Meng. Whoa, it's like a harpy. How could you have thrown yourself into such an obvious trap? I haven't even seen rats this stupid. Your crude trap won't be enough to stop me. Keep barking. 
I don't know how you managed to come back from the dead, stay hidden for all these years and then trespass into my territory. But if you're looking for a final resting place, then you've come to the right place. Your body would make a wonderful fertilizer for my crops. In a compost bin, even a skinny little twerp like you can be a valuable asset. As we farmers always say, waste not, want not. I want not from you. Stop your nonsense. I don't... Okay, <laughs> just skipped it myself. How preposterous. I think it said something about vegetables. Rise and shine, my beasts. Time for your work. Uh-oh. Is this the boss for this thing here? Oh, we're just gonna sneak peek of her, because I need another peek, I think. Who are these beasts? Whoa! It's zombie guys! Mama. Oh, I don't like that anymore. It's so dark, so- Why do they have to make them so fucked? Necro soldiers, you went so far as to revive forbidden technologies. Did you use the ape men for these? The ape men? Wait, they did have ape men uh, law in the very first one. Why do I remember that from like nine months ago? Uh, what are they called? They call like Jiang Shi or something, right? Like I only know this because as a kid I watched Shaman King and that was one of those <laughs> of like Bruce Lee. I don't fucking remember. But yeah, they have the, the talismans on their heads. I've generously allowed these two ape men to continue serving me after death. I saw the system reports before I woke up. Did you really destroy the harvesting facility in the ape farm? I personally went to Pale Blue Dot to capture them. These creatures are highly interactive and can be made to Delightfully obedient with a bit of training. So not only are we feeding these people to him, we're literally making them in a farm and using whatever traits that certain race of people have. This is so fucked up. But like the whole concept and universe of it is so cool. But understand this, whether as pets or as tools, they are subservient to us. Hey, so am I. Well, I'm gonna stop now. Enough. I didn't come to listen to a lecture. That's right. Thanks for the reminder. Time to send you on your way. I'll make it quick. I have a crop inspection scheduled for later. You beasts, use up all your powers to capture him. I'll reward you with rice once this is over. Rice! <laughs> Wait, so we're having like a double fight here, or what? Oh, what the fuck, arm? Hey, hey, guys! No, wait, not like that. Don't you saw your power there? Damn it, they hit the supports, imbeciles. Oh, well, they're just dunking on us. Great, see you later. What the hell is going on, man? This is so sick. Well, that was a good time, that. Jump, jump, uh, and bop. get away. Yep, that's those things. All right, come at me, little... There it is. Is every single being in this place... Look at that thing. Ew, it's like a fish flower guy. And they got these eggs. Oh, that's gross. Nah, that's disgusting. So this is where they're fucking born? And it's like root... Oh, roots in this case are just like veins, but they're not like secured by fucking flesh bones and skin something about it is freaking me the fuck out oh this one's shaking this is what i meant before this one is shaking which means we're gonna learn something from our master guy right yes give me more especially we can learn a new mechanic but also i want to learn some more about what the fuck what do we got charged attack okay it's not a hammer but it's a big ass fucking sword and we can of course jump around with it and dash with it yes 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 everything just keeps getting better let's try it out hey guy so can it go free can it actually go through shield oh, i can it just broke the shield well that seems fucking ridiculous we can now play the bell probably the big one and we can uh, break that wall down there so we can't go through that we can dash through it though and there's a thing down there oh there she is again boom so it's her she is like a, a bat harpy thing anything down there i don't know but let's boop god that feels good like that's also so different is that a that's a thing it's gonna hit me it's not gonna hit me all right you shoot me because i need yeah that they can live through it okay hey you boop dead can we send this guy through Nope, we can't. Let's just go over here. We need to somehow stop things here. We got a big guy. Got a big attack. Okay, that's almost a kill on me. What about I heal up here? Boom. Boom. Okay, so wait. Dash, boom. Bam, bam, boom. I need to uh get that exploded. And then bam, 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 boom. No! Almost fucked me up there, man. Get out of here. That also exploded. Oh, they explode. That's not fair. Like, I didn't know he's gonna explode. Should have probably known, though. All right, this time won't be the same. Oh, he has my things. Ooh, dodge. Boom, boom, boom. He also has that move, apparently. And then boop. And then bump, 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 bump. Nope, do a little charge here. Boom. That's so far range. I should use that more. Get away from that. Oh, he did like this. I see. Okay, and they explode each other, too. Also, that in the background is like pomegranates, but fucking eyes. It's gross. It's another one of you. What are you this time? You're a fish. Wow, a solarian. 
Uh, enjoy a sublime eternity amongst the evergreen foothills. Kunlun, the second home of your dreams. How are we doing today? It's not like I want to chat, I'm just carrying out my directives. Report region status. What who you think you are? I don't provide these to anyone. I'll fulfill my request out of pity for you. The actual crops in the agricultural region are ready for harvest. This season's harvest, our 5921st, is scheduled to be carried out today. Unfortunately, due to pending work orders and unexpected structural failures, most nodes have experienced delayed operations. We also experienced an anomalies, levels of yellow water output. I've seen that. Damaged pipelines are threatening the integrity of this entire system. Yeah, it's created by Lady Go. And it's built to last billions of years. Jesus. How do I shut off the water? <laughs> That's what I need to know. Seeing as you're so desperate to learn, I guess I can tell you a little bit about her. One can hardly talk about agriculture without mentioning our benevolent leader, Go Meng. Lady Go Meng is an extremely capable scientist. She invented the mindful method for managing crops in order to maintain optimal production. She prizes efficiency above all else. It's her belief that the greatest benefit can only be achieved through centralized control by elites. She was a successful farmer even when she was in Penglai. Her childhood experiences led her to attach great importance to food security. Precise control over aspects, including moisture, fertilizer, the length of time laborers can rest, how much they should eat, and their emotions. Some say she's obsessively pedantic, but that's how she was able to feed all of New Kunlun with limited resources. She's the greatest. Sweet, thank you. So we're gonna we need to shut off the yellow water. Use this. Uh, 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 uh. And that shuts that off. Oh, it's like our dragon heads too. Well, that's one stream at least. Hello. Boom. So, how, yeah, how much damage is that? Is it, a, is it as much as a fucking whole combo? Seems like a bit much, especially if you can use it to assassinate. Like, get an extra damage boost on it. I've lost, like, all my healing from getting... That's just fucked up. Like, that's just fucked. Let me get this stuff back here. So, does it only come... Okay, it's here. Boom. Nope. And then... Nope. Haha, uh -huh. I know all your moves, idiot. Boom. Get fucking actually owned. Oh, that guy over there, he's got the golden armor. He's a pretty healthy bell end. And now, we can jump down into that. But there are probably more things, though. Hey, you. Boom. Nope. Oh, yeah, wait, that, that you turn. Don't want to even break these, because I know what's inside of them. Oh, shit, you. Haha, uh -huh. cancelled. Nope. Nope. Oh, shit. Boom. Nope. Aw, oh, missed. Bum, bum, boom, boom, nope. Okay, okay, wait. Bum. Alright, nope. Oh, it's a double, that's right. Got that nice dodge. Bum, hey you. Boom, boom, boom. Nope. Let's charge. Bum. Oh, can I charge while blocking? Oh my god, I can. Wait, that's so sick. What? <laughs> Code. To be fair though, in a secret facility, if you have a fucking 1111 code, who's gonna guess it? Man, I cannot wait for this game to get more, like, traction. I want this to be Hollow Knight status. It probably won't be that much, but, you know, I it deserves it in my opinion, and we are not even fucking played the full game yet. This is amazing. Oh, and I also love how you, like, stop midair for that, so that you can actually aim it easier. Oh, this is where it spawns, I see. Okay. Oh, a backstab? Oh my god, there is backstab on it. What? <laughs> That's gonna do so much. We got a granary system self-monitoring results. So we gotta do a little bit of parkouring. Oh, who's gonna spawn here? Someone's gonna spawn. Oh, big spawn here. Bum. Let's see it. <gasps> An even bigger version of this. Fuck, that's such a sick design. Uh, oh, okay. Whoa. And bam, big damage. He does two. Of course he does. He leaves it. I'm not even gonna say anything. I just got owned. Like, I just got completely and fucking utterly owned. He smokescreened, left a fucking bomb behind. And he, he just got my ass with it. Like, what could I have done? Alright, I'm ready now, though. Now I know all your moves. What have I done? I also know not all your moves at all. That didn't make any sense. Be more careful. I tried to charge shit up for no reason. So, bomb. That's a one attack. That's a that attack. And he leaves behind a trail. Okay. He does not. It's a two attack, though. Okay, okay. Don't worry about me. I'm good. Nope. Nope. Okay. Bum, bum, boom. Bum, bum. Okay. I fucking, he keeps leaving behind stuff. I didn't even notice because I have my eyes on him. He's just too beautiful. No, get away from that. Nice. Okay. I'll bet. Into a boom. Cancel. Bum, bum. Beautiful. And then bum. That was a half one, but we get it back. Nope. Nope. Okay, we'll take that. I would take that too. Fuck. Nope. Okay. Get through that. 
That's really good. And bum bum. And bum bum. Fuck, you're too slow sometimes, man. Ooh. Yeah, you just got epic. My other boss fight's so good. <laughs> Background's got like spines. Let me just do that. Okay. <laughs> also, did ringing that bell do anything? Because don't we just gotta jump down there? It looks like it. Oh, okay. I see. I see. We can use the thing to get it. Okay, here it is. We just fly up. And that's sick. Okay. I need more sewers like this. Bum, 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 boom. What have we got in here? Probably something we can use, but yeah, I'm on Jade. Okay. I will remember these because the areas are actually fucking insanely memorable and I love it. So all of the salts are going to have their own like theme going. We've dropped down. They're like noses on those. What? Oh, okay. I was going to say you have a snout on you. Boom. That's uh, one of those things up there. I uh, kind of want to go back and get that, actually. All these, these guys are always trying to, like, assassinate me, man. Fuck you. Bomb. Okay, no, we need to go to both sides, it seems. Bomb, no. Oh, and boom. Double. Dutch. Okay. Bomb, bomb. Boom. Nope, nope. Kind of fucked that up a little bit, but it's fine. Leveled up again. Wait, what? How many levels do we have? Three. Okay. Oh, yeah, because we reset. It's, just, it's not the same demo. Less damage taken. More damage on our explosion. And less damage taken again, please. That's uh, not one of the small ones. Oh, behind. Get a boom. Such big damage from that. Come. Um, wait, wait, wait. Let me just counter you then. Nope. And boom. And bum, bum. I fucked both of those up. Boom. Get fucking owned, man. Nope. And no, just I mean you're too easy now. Wait. Ugh. Oh, you see that shit? First try as well. Heck that. And boom. Oh, we got a note. I need to go to the left too, man. I'm I'm afraid I'm gonna like go into a bus room. Oh. Yeah, let's not go over there yet. And boom. Let's go up here. Boom. Why is it grappling hooks so good in every game? I don't understand what it is about them that just feels so good. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, you're inside. It's fine. We got a pipe upgrade module. All right, let's go to the left now. Just before we go over and do that thing. We're jumping, we're flying. Doom. Oh, we can just dash through those and they explode too. Um, cool. Don't care about that flower up there right now. We're going over here. And jump. I need, I need that fucking... No, I don't. Oh. Path of pain in this. Boing. And... We can go this way up. Wait, I'm getting my path of pain right now. Holy shit. Wait, this is this it? What? <laughs> Since last episode, they're like, okay, he wants that. Let's do it. Even though this was created like months ago. Give me it. We got fruit of tower again. It's a big chest up here. So what is this? Give me that. A uh, big ass door. That looks important. Jump up here. Break that. Hey, you. Boom. Dash through that. I've gotten acquainted to all of the enemies of this area. We can parry on the thing. Solarian's chess set. No description. Fuck. Are you up there? Boom. Nope. Get owned. Okay, let me try this. Let me try this. So, and not iframe. That's good to know. Just, I need to know that. So, bum. Go up, go up, go up. Climb. Crawl. Do this and that. Hello. Nope. Boom. Nice. It's a big guy, this guy. I should heal up. I got so scared there. Holy shit. I, if I hadn't parried that, I'd been dead. Isn't, like, a giant hit gonna be, like... Bum. Bum. Thank fuck. Okay. And boom. Nerp. And... Got it. Alright. Cheeky. Unknown Jade. And we'd be so buff right now if we weren't in beta. This one's literally called Nine Lives. I like it. Avoid death one time when lethally injured. That's insane. Reduce internal damage caused by imprecise thing. This is good to have. And enhance recovery from internal damage whenever you attack. That's nice. Wait, now we can go in here. Wait, what? Am I like going the right way? Accidentally? Ooh. Oh, wait. This is here? What? Oh, yeah, because we do got to go out here again with the, the code. That's such a good fucking map design there. I had the guy. <laughs> Wait, he can just, oh, you can think he can survive down there, though. Oh, look at this. When you dash across a thing, you can insta-dash again when you land on the other one. Also, where am I? Let's see the ay 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 Oh, this is the big shortcut. Okay, okay. God. <laughs> this is where the movement shines. It feels so good. Wait, that dropped the thing. Golden egg. Also, I can't even do anything that way. I need to go back around. But that shortcut is to get a bigger shortcut. Probably to the boss. So, I guess we're just going back out here. To ow. Play the bell. Wait, also, we can break these now. Let's probably break shield one. Yes, yes, yes. They don't miss in this game. 
Give it to me. Probably I can use one of this, but give it to me. An unknown jade. Yes. And bam. It's probably supposed to open up. But I guess we don't have the song yet. Okay, well, let's go down again then. Do I... Little guy, can you fly up there? We need to go up there. No, but that we can't get up there from here anyway. So, yeah, this is close. We need to get in there from there. But we can't get up from up above. So, where the fuck? You know what? Maybe we just head to the right. Let me let me head over there for now, then. We know that we can go that way. But that's, like, completely in the opposite direction. If we get double jump over here, I'm gonna shit your pants. I am. Like, I would be so happy. All right. It's fighting time, though. I'm gonna charge up. Someone's gonna come and smack me up. And look at the background, though. That thing is disgusting. Oh, I love when you gotta do stuff like this, too. Uh, bump. Oh, okay. Um, is there something up here then? Or was it just for fun? Wait, we stop in here. Oh, the water rises. Also, am I like going... What? I'm so confused though, because it feels like I'm not even supposed to be here. But, oh. Hello there. What the hell is in the other place then? Maybe it's not been unlocked yet then. You sure took your time. Did you stop to smell the roses? I did actually. I knew this day would come. The others may have been ignorant, but when I first laid my eyes upon you, I knew that you were a fool, lacking in ideology, impulsive and self-righteous. It was only a matter of time before you became a hindrance to this great enterprise. Was appending the truth part of the great enterprise? Was deceiving and manipulating the council's followers part of the plan? Is that how you see things? She's in eyeballs. Great. Did you know that farmers in Chan Shan spent thousands of years domesticating and genetically modifying these delicious opto berries? Interestingly, over the same period of time, natural selection did away with every single wild opto berry plant. Without our intervention, this species would have ceased to exist. But if it existed in the first place, that means that if we were never there, it would have still existed afterwards. So it's like we, we saved it from ourselves. <laughs> what are you trying to say? Don't you understand? You up to berries, ape men, and even our fellow Solarian. Greenhouses and incubators are necessary for survival. You may see it as control, but I see it as protection. Once again, I see your point completely. And I agree. Like, you can't sit there and be like, no, she, you're fucking wrong. You're destroying the planet. We fucking eat processed meats and breed animals for food, etc. This is just, of course, more of a Moral thing here if they are actual smart almost human being creatures the weak cannot handle the truth and are incapable of making choices they require a shepherd to take care of their needs in return they only have to relinquish some of their freedom and self-consciousness all right well what makes you worthy of being their ruler Ha, trust me, I'm far more worthy than you'll ever be. You're just a hothead filled with vengeful thoughts. Have you ever considered the consequences of your actions? Well, or if you don't want to be the leader, you can make changes without being a fucking dictator. Your self-righteousness is a joke. The strong create order, and that order keeps the weak alive. That is how the universe functions. Come, let us partake in the most primitive way to settle a dispute. Nice. A battle. But I didn't get to ask you about other stuff. Oh, and she has a bell. Okay. When that rings, they awake. Control system activated. Beasts, heed my orders. This time, exterminate him for good. So, are we not fighting her, or is she part of this fight? Or is it just these two? I'm ready, though. A double fight. Goomang duo. Let's do it. Uh, 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 uh. Dutch. No, we are fighting her, actually, so... Oh, wait, we could hit that thing. Ow. Ow. What are you doing? Oh, yeah, I was gonna say, like, that looks scary. Big damage, boom, and bomb. Holy shit, I'm destroying them. He's dead. Nope, nope. Okay, it's two. Nope. Okay, ring the bell. Oh, we hit her, hit her, hit her. Boom, and boom. Okay, we almost got a half hit on that. That was insane. Nope. Bomb, bomb, boom. Out, out, out. Ow, that of course stays. Ow, that of course hurts. Nope. Alright, would be a nice with a bomb. Boom. Nope. I should probably get uh, some parries here to get my, uh, my bar back, but it's just so good to just damage. Shit, 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 shit. I don't like that. Okay, heal up. He does too many fucking big moves, this guy. Okay, double. Boom. I tried to dodge, but I didn't do it in time. Alright, I'm kind of getting fucked here. He's down. So, okay, when even one is down, she comes. Okay. There we go. I don't have any things here, so I can only do a little bit of damage. So can I break this? I can. But I killed them like it's Gosk and Duo, though. This is good. Oh, and then she comes- Oh, she comes one by one. Wait. I don't have enough time if I had my fucking more thing. Oh, man. Okay, I need to kill one more, one more, one more. So dash, boom. Nope. Break that. Okay, get out. Alright, just go for this guy. Go for this guy now. Nope. Good, good, good. We're chilling. Bomb. And dodge. 
Nice jump. Great that. Okay, okay, okay. Double hit. Boom. Nope. I'm just taking a chill, man. Bam. Good dodge. Nice fucking... Yes. Not yes. Got him, got him, got him, come, 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 come. She's coming. Charge. And... First fucking try. Oh, she's bleeding. And the things break off. Oh, they're free. I hope they just die. Because <laughs> I don't know if they can live like... I don't think they can, can they? Oh, their guts are like spilling out. I don't even notice. I cut her fucking legs off. Jesus. Okay. Curse you. Souls, apemen, the flowers and the trees. Everything could have lived on forever if we just followed the plan. Ha. <laughs> Proud of yourself now? What a travesty. Just kill me already. You don't deserve death. You must reap what you sow. You don't deserve death. What are you doing? What are you staring at me? Kill me. No. Why is my design the coldest design of all time? You've taught me a lot about your idea. Sacrifice a little bit of your free will. Oh, shit. Time to practice. Okay, okay. So they're both gonna do the same. Brainwave control activated. Damn you. That is gross, though. Look at that. Yeah, I'm just interested to know what was in the other place, though. I feel like I missed out on that. But it's all right. It maybe not explore everything now. So we can actually save something for the next... Or not for the next, but for when the game drops. Pretty soon. It's going to come out in within, like, four months, I think. Oh, we're going to see a fucking sad past. God damn it. Nine souls as well. So we, this is two... We're three souls. So it's me, my friend over there. We got his for free. And her. These are three out of the nine in total. Oh, there were ten, actually. But the last one might be the old guy or something. Oh. No. Maybe Heng is one of them. That'd be a twist. So hungry, so cold. It's her again. She's involved in all of the souls. And she's the one that fucked us up in the beginning. But she did say something before she pushed us off the cliff. I'm very interested in her. She has a cool design too. Join us. Un only the council can turn your ideals into reality. Okay, so she's the head of the council. Well done, my children. Work hard and I'll let you live longer than the others. Those are the two. Yeah, and these. That way you'll always be by my side. See, this is the thing, man. They're gonna do this with everyone. They're gonna make me feel bad for every single character but it doesn't excuse all the fucked up shit they like done work the fields alongside the people that way no one will ever go hungry again in all of ping lai right so i guess maybe like it all got to a head along the way i mean if you do this for so long it's only natural especially if you aren't interacting with others to keep you grounded which is why a position where you are alone controlling such a big place is like in my opinion never a good idea and it's probably gonna end now yeah i'm very interested to like know what's in the other place i feel like i might have missed out on the little boss or something but we're actually not gonna do any of it because i'm gonna save it and also i've been playing for a long time and have more than enough for a video here so what is this to say that i haven't seen and all the previous ones. This is, in my opinion, gonna be, like, the next top indie game. Uh, I, I think it deserves it 100%. This is, like, next level. Well, actually, I wanna add now that I'm 20 million times more invested in the story. Slash lore. It's so much more interesting now that we figured out just a little bit more about what's going on. That whole conversation with, uh, Root Hing was so good. I very much encourage you to check this game out. You can check out the first demo. It's still on Steam, of course, for free, if you wanna try it yourself, and, of course, wishlist it to help out the devs when the game actually drops. I'm not sure this this game cannot be in top three this year even with all the crazy games coming out this is so fucking amazing and we're not even like an eighth into this i don't know how long this game is but judging from the amount of souls and how much we've done and they're always been like an end game i guess we'll see so yes please if you enjoyed this video leave a like on it helps out so much leave a funny comment too i love reading them check out my twitter second channel stream merch links are in the description of course subscribe if you're new around here and as always my name is smith and thanks for watching